I always say that. And yeah, yeah. I barely know how to edit this. It's so freaking dark. Super dark. What's up, guys? Anyways, just got to the gym. It's Sunday. I just had some orange leaf, six ounces of frozen yogurt, um, 50 grams of strawberries, and then the sprinkles. I don't really count because it's almost like nothing. And then I do two frosted animal cookies trapped. So we're gonna hit legs and we'll see how it goes. Let's see how much footage I can get. So I figured I would leave some of the gym background noise there to be a little bit different but here I am starting it off by foam rolling because this really releases any tension that I have in my legs especially because I do have um, a really tight left hip and then a bad right knee so foam rolling before I do my leg workout really helps a lot. Also, I learned from Amanda Bucci that doing uh, hip bridges and single leg hip bridges really opens up your hips for leg day. So I've been doing that lately and honestly, it does help a lot. I am also going to be doing some side to side just to again warm up my hips and then I always like to do my body weight squats just to get all the joints and all the other muscles going. And we're starting with the leg extensions. These are what the name says, extensions. So make sure you are extending your full leg and not like at a 45 degree angle. Is one of my not so fair workouts but I really do love how much it makes my under glute burn and just feel amazing um, these are a bit challenging I guess because of the angle but I am doing three sets of eight here I was supposed to be doing leg press but the machine was taken so I used this which the mechanisms are a little bit different but it still really works out my quad so I decided to do it and for this one I am doing 4 sets of 10 reps. on to a more traditional workout which are walking lunges here I am really focusing on getting low to really make sure I am firing up those quads and for the lunges I did four sets of 16 super setting with the dumbbell squats which you will see in a second Since it is a quad focused workout today, you do want to go as low and deep as you can. If it would have been more of a hamstring or glute, I wouldn't have gone as low. I would have just kept the tension higher up. back with the leg extensions but this time as a tricep so for leg extensions I did 4 by 10 and then after that I did seated calf raises again 4 by 10 and as the last set I did 4 sets of 15 reps for dumbbell calf raises
now you probably won't even feel your calves but to finish off this leg day I did single leg dumbbell calf races I did three sets of 15 each leg and when you do these you do want to make sure you are elevated somewhere to really extend the calves <music> pressure on my knee so I do incline treadmill when I want to have like an easier Carter session so basically what I do is I sit it for 35 minutes level elevate it to level 4 and then speed warm up at 2.0 and then I'll do the rest of a cardio at 3.5 so yeah I'll see you guys after the session See you guys 